and as part of efforts to tackle endemic corruption and fraudulent activities in Nigeria, a non-governmental organization has organized a town hall meeting on anti-corruption and promotion of good governance in Port Harcourt, River State Capital. The group Wadata Media Advocacy Center WAMAC used local communities as change agents to fight corruption. Speaking on the air sense of the meeting, the leader of the Wadata Media and Advocacy Center, Zuber Idris, says the workshop is meant to appraise new concepts in fighting corruption with a view to reducing corrupt practices in Nigeria through citizens' participation. Corruption is not only synonymous with monetary terms, but also certain moral acts and inappropriate behaviors of public servants towards service delivery. Access to information is the oxygen of democracy, and we must all work to make information and records available to the public for the promotion of good governance. Idris says the recent developments in the NDDC have given ray of hope to various communities to be more proactive and resilient in discussing anti-corruption issues. Other resource persons at the training say the fight against corruption will not succeed without active citizens' participation, especially local communities. Our com commitment to the promotion of good governance and promotion of accountability in this project and concept by Madata Media Advocacy Center, it is our hope that our various communities will own the fight against corruption and demand for accountability by political leaders. So we should go down to the grassroots. Let us go down to the grassroots. Let us let our people know the enormity of this problem. When we speak the language they understand, then they will do what we want them to do. The earlier we stand and say no to it, collectively, it's not just one person's fight. If we stand and say no to it, I believe it will, it will stop. And how do we do it? At least through education, sensitization, China actually said it long ago. The problem with Nigeria, he said, was leadership. But on our part, let's reinvent our communities. And that is where this program is most relevant. Let's still make our community money too unsafe for the local government chairman and the commissioner from our place to touch. I'm advocating that there should be, uh, maybe education will help us. And I know that civics is. Uh, it's lost. Now, we don't teach civics these days in our schools. And I think those kind of uh, civic education should return. The community is not equipped. EFCC man talked about the languages, yes. But the community is not equipped. There's no capacity building at the community level to enable the community to help us in the fight against corruption. The theme for the gathering is community participation in the fight against corruption in Nigeria using local languages. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.